Um, I just want to, you know, give a shout out to Alabama for, you know, the great game they gave us. You know, I just give it all to my team. You know, they found me and I just made open shots. Cavell, your your playing time's kind of fluctuated here recently. I mean, how, how much, how important is it for you to kind of put on a show like that whenever you do get opportunities to have um, extended playing time? I realize it's not really about you know how much minutes you play. It's how how productive how productive you are in the minutes you play. So I just try to go out there and be productive as I can. And you know, if my minutes get increase, if they decrease, you know, I'll still go out with the same effort and help the team. Uh, this can be for anybody, but uh, you guys kind of fluctuated a little bit at the free throw line this year, but you know, 22, 27 at the line tonight. I mean, just how important was it that you guys shot that efficiently at the free throw line? All right, um, well, in practice, Coach Wade said we're shooting pretty much uh, like 86%, so that's something that we've been just focused on. Uh, just been drilling after every, well, practice is based off of like two halves, so I did and then the first half, you know, we shoot free throws. And based off of our percentage in practice, everything has been going well. So we just stepped up to the line in the game and trying to knock them in. Uh, to any of the players, can you guys put a finger on how, you know, you've had some really big leads that have gotten kind of narrowed in the second half there? Can you repeat the question? Can, can you put a finger on why sometimes you, have, you guys have had some huge leads that have gotten a little bit close there at the end? Uh, I would say we just come out uh, – Back to days ago, like we don't come out with the same energy. But as the season has been going on, I feel like we've gotten a lot better. Our team is um, with me on that. Like we all feel the same way about it, and it's just something that we're gonna just continue to chip away at. Cavell, you watched this team play Alabama from the sideline last year. When you were sitting out on the sideline last year, was this a game? This was a game that Will pointed out, saying, "Yeah, we need some size for this one." Was it? Was this a game that you kind of targeted? Uh, last year and said, yeah, I can make an impact. Um, I mean, I didn't be really target a specific game, but uh, obviously, you know, it's SEC. It's a, it's a great league. There's great players in the league, so I'm always going to you know, be up. You know, next week we got to play August, so we got great players. So I'm always going to offer the test with whoever I'm playing. You know, it doesn't matter who. Uh, Trey, we've touched on that a little bit, but um, how big was Javante as well as Darius off the bench today? Um, Obviously, everyone has seen like how the season has been going, and uh, Javante didn't have a great game last game. He didn't feel like, but I just been trying to tell him to just stay true to it because if you don't have a good game, I'm gonna have an okay game. If I'm not having a good game, you're gonna have a good game. So I feel like we're just coming together, and the way he's playing, it's shown that he has more confidence. He's he's uh, willing to listen, and just Darius is just a a stretch four that can play the three, but may also make big shots. So to have them coming off uh, the bench tonight was a huge help for me. Javante, how much did it help to see that first three fall? And then that last one in the first half, was that a heat check? It looked like you kind of stepped back and was just seeing how hot you were at the moment. Um, it felt real good, you know, to help us get the lead. And then the last shot, I just felt like it was going in. So I just, you know, helped the team with confidence. How important is it to start off a, a SEC slate with a win? I mean, last year you, you guys opened with a loss, but I mean, how, how, how much can you build off of a win opening as a win? As a whole, like as a team, it just it just boosts our confidence. It just gives us that, uh, that extra edge going into Arkansas, knowing that obviously we got this win, but to start off with a win, it's always a good thing. But now we have to go somewhere else, and obviously they're going to have their home crowd, so we have to learn how to just stay together. and. Obviously, we're a young team, so we got to just be able to keep it within our family. Whoever travels with us, the only, only people that's going to be with us, so we got to be able to um, just keep a tight knit team. <clears throat> Tremont, 11 0 at home this season. Obviously, uh, protecting your home court, that's, that's, that's big when you get into league play. Just how important, uh, I guess, has that been with Will Wade and, and him kind of drilling that into you guys? Well, basically, now, last year, he. Um, he said we needed pretty much every home game to solidify a, a um, March Madness spot, and we kind of let it slip away with uh, like Stephen F. Austin. Um, I, I can't remember who else. Georgia. 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 Um, so just this year we have a, a much different approach. Like we're not going to second guess ourselves. We know that this is home court, and it's it's guaranteed. Like we have to. There's there's no other option. We have to get the games at home. So we're just 
humble about it, just keep working, and every time we step on the court, we just give it all. Thank you guys. Appreciate you. Appreciate it.